Hi, Alan here again. We've had a great barbecue this afternoon. The weather was very kind to us. Um, the reason the barbecue was my beautiful niece here is actually off to Adelaide to go and live there. And uh, although well, she's been there before, she's decided to emigrate, take her family with her. Um, so we decided not only um, to have the barbecue, because uh, it's typical Australian style cuisine, of course, but we actually matched it with some wines with that. Um, she will be enjoying over there because Adelaide, of course, is in the Rossa Valley area, 60 kilometres away. So she's going to the most um, amazing destination and a great, a great wine, a great wine country too. We started with a um, quite a, an inexpensive Shiraz, Tesco's own brand, under five quid. And what you see is what you get. Uh, it's okay to start with. Quite enjoyed it. Um, but then we moved on to something a lot more interesting. A wine called Heirloom, a quite a young vineyard. It has only I've been going since about to the year 2000, I think. Um, now this is a real good example of how Shiraz should be from this particular region. Of course, it's um, Australia made Shiraz famous. It's, it's its own brand, its own great variety, really. Um, this was full of spice, full of licorice. Uh, it was jammy. It was it was. Um, great taste of, 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 uh, of red fruits, of plums, damsons, and I'm really quite envious that you're going over there to live, and it's only right next door to you. Yep. So what do you think? Did you, you've been, it was your choice of wine anyway, so yep. you've had it before, haven't you? We have, my um, husband and I tried it before, so we thought we'd have it again, because we thought you might enjoy it, and you did. And I did, yeah, it was brilliant. So you can see she's all dressed up, ready to go, very acclimatised to the whole thing, and all I'm going to say is, bon voyage, and hopefully I'll be there next year and you can show me around.